Welcome to the Regional Sports Centre Scotland North and East's guide to downloading and installing the upgrade patch for My Study Bar version 3. When downloading the file, make sure you choose a location that will be easy to find once the download is completed. This can be your desktop or perhaps your My Documents folder. Whatever is convenient. Simply go with the name that's suggested and click on the Save button. Depending on your internet connection, it may take a several minutes for the download to finish. Once completed, to begin the process, double-click on the file. You may have to give your permission to run the file, in which case click on the Run button. On the screen that's presented, simply click Next to continue. You'll be prompted to make sure that your drive is connected to the PC. Once you're sure that it is connected, click on Next to continue. You now have to tell the software where the drive is located. Click on the three dots and then select the drive letter where your USB is connected. If successful, you should see these two folders, Commons and FS Command, appear. Click on OK. Then click Next. The program will check that you have the right version to be updated. If it is the correct one, then you can click on the Start button. The update process should take a few minutes. Once you've reached 100%, Simply click on Exit. Now it's important to check that everything's gone smoothly, so navigate to your USB drive and launch My Study Bar, which should have changed to version 3. You'll see a few changes in the programs. Under Writing, you'll now see the Tiny Spell Spell Checker and Rapid Typing Touch Type Tutor. Let Me Type now has a few added lexicons which you can check out. We've also added the Thunder Screen Reader, an improvement on the previous version of NVDA that was included with My Study Bar version 2. Please check for updated online tutorials from the Help menu. Thank you for updating to version 3 and we hope you enjoy using our product.